Nest. Second night on the recliner, broken shoulders slung. The wife brings unsweetened tea and Demerol, unfurls an extra blanket over my legs. Earlier, she walked the dogs with me when we came across a bird nest descending from an electrical box suspended on vinyl apartment building wall. The dogs strained their leashes. She found the featherless chick huddled in the dirt with two cigarette butts, a splintered bick, and a crushed plastic cap blindly crawling. She handed her leash to my good arm, the pulling dogs intent on the prize, retrieved the straining creature, returned it to the nest, which she stuffed back up into the box. We knew, but hoped for the best, herded the dogs homeward. In our closet, she finds my winter hat on the floor and pulls a featherless man from inside, penniless, supporting bones cracked, trust fled with the mortgage, lifts him slowly, tells him what he's never heard before, the twigs and twine and tatter of his days gathered and woven, sets him softly in his nest.